Good morning guys. It's a brand new day. I've made my breakfast and I'm ready to dive into it and see how the day goes. Hi guys. I'm about to head out to my little picnic date uh, this is so random i hadn't planned for that but i think we're gonna work with that but the weather is so gloomy i don't know if it's going to rain but my date is not coming on so well i wish i planned this earlier but no problem because i'm looking all cute or whatever Let's see what the picnic day is I just took out my twist. I love how curly it is. And I put some gel on it. My little pin here and then beads. Then my puff, which is beautiful. Why did I come to a picnic? It's because I'm so happy. I think that's my ultimate goal. That's what I'm pursuing. I don't think finances will make me happy because what I believe is I won't lack what I need. I don't have to be super rich to be happy. That's what I've tattooed in my mind. If I want food, I will have it. Because first of all, I am a child of God. I'm a Christian and I believe what the Bible says is true. Whatever you ask in Jesus' name, you'll find it. Mm -hmm. Pursuing success is probably not my ultimate goal i mean i want to be successful but like i said i don't have to have that to be happy life isn't just happiness there are times which are really terrible and there are times when all you want to do is cry i want the good times to last the sun is not out where are you son where are you son <laughs> You've seen my first three videos and especially the most recent it's called the most important thing most people go through a lot of hardships and breakdowns they just won't admit it they think that people don't understand them i've been there and when i'm stressed or when i'm going through a mental breakdown i just want to lie on my bed with my laptop or my phone just crawling through reels and tiktok and just distract myself and not think about anything you know and I, I don't want to be around people that's exactly what I used to do my point is whether you have depression or a mental breakdown it's okay it's okay you're, you're not alone you're not you're not the only person going through that and I think you have to see some beauty in your life you have to see how beautiful you are how beautiful your family is. we're all going through different stuff it all comes down to strength you know when you break free from all this stuff like depression and anxiety the problem comes in when you don't break free because depression or anxiety like i said in the video it doesn't just disappear it doesn't just go the mental breakdown the stress you just learn to cope with it i read from a quote it said a person that overcomes his own desires is the strongest person i think that's so accurate it's so cold i'm thankful that i brought my jacket along but still not enough <gasps> wish i brought some chai ay 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 so cold but it's so beautiful i think i prefer this weather no 
one actually told me that life is going to be this tough. No one told me that I was going to be bullied one time. No one ever says that. Until you get to your adulthood and you find this life there staring at you like just wants to eat you up. I talk about perfectionism, which is a phrase used to brainwash ambitious and innocent people, right? When you get to social media and look at Instagram and you think, wow, I wish I would live in such places. I wish I had such hair. I wish I had such skin. Perfectionism is a scam. Morning routine. Someone waking up at 4 a.m., you think, wow, this person is the most disciplined person I know. You just saw a video. No one is perfect and no one will ever be perfect. So you can just be happy, be free. If you're type of person that is corny or cheesy, there's nothing wrong with that. Your hair should be straight. You need to show a little skin. It's all societal pressure and if you ascribe to it, girl, you lost. I'll tell you that for sure. just finished the zoom call and we had so much fun with my um with my friends and i hope to have such zoom call we've got the end of this video thank you but that means a lot to me that you support me bye guys i love